went down a little bit. Got to keep our momentum up, man. Keep keep our foot on their neck and keep keep pushing, and being aggressive. Do you feel like you let off? Like, why do you think that happened? Uh, I don't know what happened, man. It's just the momentum changed. Unfortunately, we was on the other end of it, and that's all I could tell you. In your experience, what can you do to get that back in a situation like this? All we could do is, you know, keep that taste in our mouth, go back to practice. But, you know, it's the first game of the season. I mean, unfortunately, we wanted to get the win, but we didn't. But we got, we got a lot of time to get better and learn from this and, you know, go back to the drawing boards. Some of those plays happen, like the block and the park move can sort of feel momentum shifting in the stadium a little bit. How much do you feel like it affects an offense or a team as a whole when you feel momentum changing mid-game? Uh, it can affect them if you allow it. I mean, you know. You know, we, we practice hard and, you know, put ourselves in situations to know that, you know, we don't, we practice with crowd noise and everything, so that shouldn't really affect us, but, you know, they did pretty good today. I mean, we can't, you know, sit there like they're not pros or nothing, but, you know, they did good and we just got to go back to the drawing board and get better. A game that, you know, has a lot of self-inflicted wounds for, for your guys here, I mean, does it get easier to deal with moving forward knowing like, hey, we, we should have and could have won this game? <laughs> we should have won the game. We should have won the game. I mean... We should have won the game. That's all I can say. We should have won the game. Go back to the drawing boards. Get better. I mean, we were we looked pretty decent in the beginning. I mean, I'm not. We just gotta, you know, learn from this and get better. On the deep ball that will kind of underthrew you. Just kind of what happened there? Did, did you think you had it? Like, what was the situation there? I gotta honestly. I can't wait to get on the plane and look at you know what I did wrong and what I did all right. But uh, yeah, I was running. Uh, I'm looking like this first, but the ball was way inside, so. Now I'm making a turn, and I just, I didn't, I don't know. He just got there a little bit before me, I guess. I didn't know where he was, honestly. Did, were you impressed by how Will handled the situation? I know it was a tough game for him. Just kind of how did he handle the day? I mean, he did a, I mean, I thought he was doing a great job. I mean, unfortunately, we lost as a team today. I mean, we all weren't, wasn't good enough, period. I mean, we were we're still we were still giving our you know our best energy out there, still encouraging each other. But you know, we just we just came up short, you know, in the times that we needed to make a play. And yeah. can you put a finger on why that was? Uh, we just lost momentum, I feel like, and then we just couldn't you know couldn't get a get a spark back. Brian said he felt like the offense was just out of rhythm. He was out of rhythm as a play caller. What does an offense need to do to get rhythm back? Just make a play. You just so one guy make a play, and that'll open up everything. You know, it'll give everybody around us confidence, and the momentum will just open up everything else. It's very frustrating, you know, especially when the defense play how they played today. Um, and um, you know, we we pretty much gave them the game. You know, they didn't really get points on offense, so we just got to be better and, and not beat ourselves. Definitely. Um, you know, we're better than that. We know we're better than that. And, um, you know, we'll clean it up next week. Um, I think we did a good job uh, first half, you know, coming out, being aggressive, um, being physical up front. You know, O-line did a great job creating holes for me.